Okay. Hey guys, it's me, Amelia, and today we are going to changing the Dexcom G5 on me. <laughs> so Q has a CGM now, which is short for Continuous Glucose Monitor. And it monitors his blood sugar 24 hours a day. We get the readings on his phone. Um, so he has a lot less finger pricks. He still has to prick three his fingers. Three a day. Yeah, usually about three times a day. But it's much um, easier. Easier, yes. And we like knowing what his blood sugar is at all times of the day. So we're going to show you how he puts one on. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to get out his sensor. This is what you apply the sensor with, and it actually is uh, a needle that goes underneath the skin. And we're going to just clean the area. <laughs> the needle word. <laughs> we're going to clean the area first. I thought we'd pick out the spot first. Well, I think we're good. This arm looks pretty good. We have to make sure that we don't put it in a spot that's already been... Like this. Scarred up, yes. Okay, then we use a kind of a sticky alcohol swab. Where are we putting this? We're going to put it right here. I don't know where it right there is. It's not wood. To kind of prep the area to make sure it will stick. Okay, the next thing we need to do is we need to take the the back off of it. Be very careful not to um, touch the adhesive. Right, we try to keep everything really clean. I learned that the hard way. And it is super sticky. And also make sure you clean your hands really well before you do any of this. you're gonna do like a lot of processes to make sure your kid is very very distracted. I don't know, I don't know where you're putting this. Right here. Oh boy. This is gonna hurt. It doesn't hurt that bad does it Hugh? Only if you pinch mm. a lot. <laughs> okay so here is the important part. This is what they call the key. And as soon as you take the key out, this becomes very sensitive. And I learned that the hard way because I took no, the key out. I learned that the hard way. <laughs> and then I accidentally just barely touched it and it stuck him. So as soon as we take the key out, we try to just go ahead and insert it. And always save the key because later we'll show you something. Keep that in mind. Okay, so here I go taking the key out. You just slide it right out on top. Okay. Then at the same time that you push down on the white, you pull up on the plunger. And make sure you kind of pinch the skin. We also or, learned that the hard way. Or it will hurt your child very, very <laughs> bad. Yeah, I think it helps to pinch the skin and get a good layer okay. of fat. On my mark. Ready? Two, two, three, two. That time actually felt pretty good. You're getting daddy level. <laughs> Woohoo! Okay, so the next step is to take the plunger out, which you squeeze these little tabs that you squeeze and you just pull the plunger out. And those tabs she's talking about are those little marks. You can't see them on the camera, but they are very, very little and they have stripes. Now the, the last step is to put the transmitter back on. The transmitter is what actually will send the information to his phone. So we reuse the transmitter. It is good for 90 days. So we just clean the transmitter. And to me, this is actually the hardest part, putting it on, because you have to get it just squeezed in just right. There's a little lever. Oh, I did it. Good that wasn't too bad, <laughs> was it? So then this lever, you twist off. And then, remember, remember we told you to keep the key in mind? So when you're taking this off, you have to, the key comes in very important on taking this off. Exactly. Now his phone says, tap to start two hours since a warm up. I'll get it a close up. 
No, it is red. Okay, so you tap that, and it will say warm up started, and it'll still say the same thing, and it takes two hours to do. Okay, and the very last thing that we do, which is something we just, you don't have to do, but we like to do because it helps keep his sensor on when he's swimming and when he's running this around, um, we put a patch on it, and this cute little hot dog patch and much of others is from the, the sugar patch. And you see there's a little thing right there. You just pop that thing out and stick hey, it Hey, Amelia, can you pop it out for us? That would be fun. And I am going to put, we also use skin tack to help it stick. You this, can order this on Amazon. That's right. The skin tack is incredibly sticky. Sticky. So we also learned that the hard way. <laughs> I put a layer around just on the adhesive. And then I have to run run one lap around the house. There he goes. And run. Go. Bye him. <laughs> He'll be back in a second. I saw him run into something. We ran into the ice Okay, chest. so now it's kind of dry enough to where we can put, put the, the sugar hot dog on. And see, it's right here. I just popped that little thing out and I showed you where the hole is. Hugh loves to eat. So anything related to food. He just gobbles down. He gobbles down and he likes to wear on his arm. Yeah. <laughs> that, Turn your arm a little bit. This sometimes way. he even puts food that, on his arm. Is that arm right hot dog? Or is that the part that you pinched out? This? That's the part we pinched out. We pinched out. Dang it. See? Good. He's very sensitive to food. All right, Amelia, what are you going to tell him while I'm putting this on? Nothing. <laughs> <laughs> we have to wait till you're done. Okay, I'm done. And you have to look at the camera. Okay. <laughs> and don't touch his arm. All right, so that is it. That is changing Q's CGM. Yes. And, and go ahead. And don't forget to click the subscribe button so you do not miss. And like and try to get this video to 115 likes. And don't forget to smash that bell button. But you so you. No, I didn't. So you don't miss any of our posted videos right when we post them. So yeah. And also don't forget, if you would like any more information about living with type 1 diabetes, check out my blog, The Sacred, The South, and Sugar, where we share our experience uh, with our family and type 1 diabetes. And make sure to look out for um, a video about us. What was it? Reading um, comments, comments the questions from about diabetes from y'all. So, so uh -huh. look out for that in about a month or so. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> All right, tomorrow. thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.